We move on to the fifth. Phillies and Mares going, none winners in their last seven. On the run, four to one, Jim Darty on the rail. Yankee Knight, your six to five favorite with Ron Pierce out of the two hole. Worthy Time Rose at seven to two with Bill Fahey. Bloodstock BG, seven to one, Bill O'Donnell. Nine to one on Midgey Hanovener. Randy's Image, 19 to one with Mike Lachance. How's about a kiss? John Campbell on the outside at 10 to one. Here's the fifth race. Randy's Image. Sprinting from the far outside. Worthy Time Rose is there. How's about a kiss from the far outside? On the run is now fourth toward the rail. Yankee Knight is racing in fifth position, followed by Freelancer. And then it's Hobo Patry. To the back of the pack, Bloodstock's BGs. And the early trailer is Midgey Hanover. Field rounding the first turn. And up top, Worthy Time Rose by the quarter in 28 and 4 fifth seconds. Racing in second position is Ranny Zamage, who continues to sit the pocket. On the run is racing in third. From the outside, a quick brush from Yankee Knight. Yankee Knight now coming quickly. Right by on the run, passing Ranny's image and up after the leader, Worthy Time Rose. Yankee Knight now takes the lead as they continue down the back stretch over to the half mile pull toward the inside. Worthy Time Rose is racing second. They hit the half in 58 and 1 fifth seconds. Farther back, it's Ranny's image racing in third position. On the run has moved off the rail fourth. How's about a kiss along the inside? Racing in fifth. Freelancer is second over six. Bloodstock's BGs is seventh on the outside. Then it's Hobo Patry toward the rail. And Midgey Hanover, they're moving midway around the turn. Yankee Knight up top now. Pressure coming from on the run. Yankee Knight a half length on the run right there. Worthy Time Rose is just in behind them at the rail. Freelancer on the outside. Right there racing in third. Ranny's image has been shuffled back. Fifth toward the inside. Bloodstock's BGs is sixth. And they're off the turn and in the lane. And Yankee Knight still resisting the challenge of on the run. Yankee Knight fighting back with something left here on the outside on the run and toward the rail. Worthy Time Rose is locked in. Here comes Ranny's image with a clear shot on the outside. Yankee Knight still there. Ranny's image. Here's the wire and it is a photo finish. Yankee Knight in a fast closing. Ranny's image. Cat Manzi was supposed to drive Yankee Image tonight. He missed his mounts. Ron Pierce will be in to pick up the pieces on this shipper from Freehold. Six-year-old by Crackers, Yankee Knight sits off the initial quarter of 28 and 4. Worthy Time Rose was the leader at that station. Yankee Knight urged to the front by Pierce just before the half. They go down the road from there. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a clear case of a class call. At Freehold, now winners of 600 for start, racing against good male stock. And then, in the winners over 15,000 for Phillies and the Mayors, dropped into a nice soft spot here at the Meadowlands. Yankee Knight proves to be much the best. Interesting to see the nine, uh, Rainey's image, trapped at the rail until very late under Michael Chance's sword closing stoutly late to get second on the run challenge of three quarters ended up third this time maybe patience didn't pay off for Lachance he comes up just a bit short your six to five winner Yankee Knight pays four sixty three dollars and two sixty Rainey's image eleven forty and five sixty on the run shows three dollars and twenty cents your two nine exacta in race number five pays sixty nine dollars and forty cents